Introduction to the Cornerstone Learning Management System. The Home Landing Page. Home and learning are the two main content areas for all employees. The Home Landing Page will allow you to see A, your transcript, B, featured training, and C, pending evaluations. Search for training. Option 1. In the search box in the top right corner of the home page, input the name of the training course in the search box, then click the search icon. All courses and training sessions available by that title will populate. Option 2. Browse for training. On the home landing page, scroll over the Learning tab to view drop-down options. Click the Browse for Training option to view all of the training classes listed by number and alphabetical order. On the Browse for Training page, you can find different ways to search for training. The left side of the page displays those options. We have the option to view and select training sessions by clicking on My Subjects, these are topics of interest. Featured, those courses are highlighted by professional development. Popular, these courses are frequently selected. And newest. There are various icons for the types of training available. Online classes, events, curriculum, and materials. You also have additional search options date range, full calendar view, and location. Once you find a course, click on its title. When you click the training title, the session will expand to allow you to view the session details, the number of available seats, as well as the dates and times of the class. Enroll in training. Option 1. Enroll in an instructor-led session. To enroll in a session, click the Request tab. The system will redirect you to the transcript page. Once you're scheduled, the action items to withdraw and view training details will be available in the View Training Details drop-down. Option 2. Enroll in an online course. Go to the Learning tab to view drop-down options. Click the Browse for Training option. Select an online training course by clicking on its title. To enroll, click Request. Launch an online course. Once the online course is requested, click the Launch Action tab in your transcript. A new window will appear, directing you to a Skillsoft page. Click Play This Course. The menu and course overview will appear. Select the Play icon and the video will start. Withdraw from a training class. To withdraw from a session, you can click Withdraw under your transcript on the home page or you can go to the Learning tab drop-down. Select View Your Transcript. Click on the View Training Details drop-down box by the training class title in your transcript. Click Withdraw. The Withdraw Registration page will appear. The Withdrawal Registration screen requires a justification for removing the class. To select a reason, click the drop-down box under Withdrawal Options. Select the appropriate reason and click Submit. The withdrawal is complete when your transcript reflects the option to select Session in the Action drop-down box by the class title. If you have canceled a session, new sessions will be available to select from your transcript under Select Session only if new sessions are available. If new sessions are not available, the training details will appear but the option to request will not. You may select the option, Notify me of new sessions.
View and print your transcript, option one. The home landing page will allow you quick access to the icon, your transcript, which allows direct access to your transcript and various action items depending on the training class status. Hover over the widget until the finger pointer option appears and then click. Option two. On the learning tab, there will be three options in the drop-down: view your transcript, events calendar, and browse for training. To open your transcript, hover over the My Learning tab and select View Your Transcript. In the transcript page, you can view details and request specific sessions. You can also withdraw from instructor-led training, launch online learning, complete training evaluations, and view training scores. The transcripts have action tabs linked to each training option on the right side of the class titles to show the class status, such as view training details, launch, expired, and open curriculum. On the transcript page, you will see your active courses by default. These are either courses in which you have self-enrolled, any mandatory training you've not yet completed, or any training sessions assigned to you by your supervisor. To see transcripts of courses you have already completed, select Completed from the drop-down menu. You can clean up your active listing by archiving a class you have decided not to take. To archive a requested course, select View Training Details, then select Move to Archive Transcript. Finally, select Archive. These courses will now appear on the Archived tab. Complete Class Evaluations After attending an instructor-led session, you will be expected to complete an evaluation. Training sessions that require a class evaluation will be posted on the home landing page under Pending Evaluations. If an evaluation is posted, you will see Evaluate. Click Evaluate. When the survey opens, answer the supporting survey questions about the training session and click Submit. If no evaluations are due, there will be no pending evaluation. Now that you've completed a quick tour of Cornerstone, you can log into the system. Open the Chrome browser, which is recommended, and then type in the following URL into the Omnibar. https colon forward slash forward slash pgcc.csod.com forward slash s-a-m-l-d-e-f-a-u-l-t dot ASPX question mark OUID equals 2. In Cornerstone, you may have to enable pop ups in your Chrome browser. If you need help doing so, click the Chrome icon to view a brief tutorial. Don't worry about the long address. We will provide a button at the bottom of the page that will start the login process. After entering the address or clicking the button, you will log into MyPGCC with your PGCC email address and password, and you will then be directed to Cornerstone's home landing page. Close the pop-up window on your screen to begin.